welcome to a brand new video on the Basel United Superfans YouTube channel. Today, you're probably wondering why I'm wearing a Bowers and Pitsy scarf. Um, it's because Basel and United's game against Folkestone and Victor got pulled off tonight, unfortunately. So we're doing a bit of ground hopping. We're going to watch our second local team, which is Bowers and Pitsy, of course. So, um, yeah, Mia, are you excited to watch the game? Yeah. Yeah, so tonight, Bowers and Pitsy, they're facing Brightling Sea and Regent. Um, who are based in like Clacton, I think, sort of Clacton way. So yeah, it's pretty dark right now because, uh, well, Basildon doesn't like to be very lit up in at night. It has a reputation for that. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, so sorry you can't see us very well. Um, but basically, yeah, just thought rather than staying in and not getting any football in, why not do a ground up in video? Also, as there is a chance that Basildon United's game might not go ahead this weekend as well because. The pitch is just horrendous at our ground at the moment. Um, but yeah, so we're heading to enemy territory tonight rather than um, going somewhere else. Because um, I haven't actually done a Bowers and Pitsy ground hopping video. I have been to Bowers, like for example for Frimford. Um, I've been to Bowers for Basel and United against Bowers and Pitsy as well. Um, of course so has Mia as well. Um, but yeah. Um, so yeah, should be a good game. I think Bowers are in decent form recently. I don't know about Bright Lindsay. I'll, um, I'll update that in a minute, like talk about the place in the table and that kind of stuff um, and their recent form when we get to the ground. We're literally up the road from the ground now. We're just walking up there. Have about, I think, 15 minutes till kickoff. So yeah, hopefully be a good game. And uh, I'm not going to say come on you Bowers, but hopefully be an entertaining game. So we're right at the ground. The noise, obviously, obviously it's a 3G pitch. There was no chance in this game being pulled off. Uh, yeah, looking forward to the game. Demir, your first time coming to this ground since it's had the new stand put up. What's your first impressions? All right, actually, it's pretty decent. Yeah, yeah. much better than how it used to look. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Score prediction very quickly. Um. Well, obviously, Bowser did all right. Yeah. 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 Quite near the yeah. bottom of the league though. So I think I'm actually happy. I'm going to go for a 3-1 win to Bowers. 3-1 win to Bowers, yeah, it's pretty decent. I might, I'm going to go with a 2-0 win to the Bowers. Um, yeah, hopefully it'll be an entertaining game. Hopefully it won't be just like Bright Bowers dominate. Hopefully Bright and will have some good chances of their own. But it would be good to see Bowers get a win, even though obviously Bowers are rivals with them. Um, but yeah, players are out on the pitch. And uh, yeah, let's get on with the vlog. Kick off between Bowers and Pitts in Brighton and seeing Regent. Hopefully, there we go. Free kick to Bowers and Pitts. Brad Warner, ex Basel United player. He's going to whip it into the box from the look to it. Yes. Oh, what a shot! And there it is, it's 1 0 Bowers and Pitsy. A stunning strike from outside of the area, and it's gone bottom left, cow, uh, bottom left corner. Keeper had no chance. 1 0 Bowers and Pitsy, a stunning strike. And uh, yeah, that gets the game going nice and early. What was your thoughts on that goal? Very good. Very good. It's a stunning strike, wasn't it? Yeah. Another good chance for Bowers. Brad Warner. A stunning strike. Max by the save. Oh, it's 2 0 Bowers and Pitsy. Oh, in quick succession, they've scored two goals. And a, head, a, a brilliant strike from Brad Warner is saved by the keeper. Comes out. And the Brighton Sea and Regent defender gets a touch on it and deflects into the back of the net. And 2 0 Bowers and Pitsy, they've scored two in quick succession. A brilliant start for the Bowers. Can you explain how you feel for Brighton Sea right now? They, they, look, they look really sad. Sad. I feel so bad for them. Well, they have just conceded two goals in like yeah, the first five. Yeah, but they look on their faces were so disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> Mia feels sorry for the Brighton sequence. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Bowers and Pitsy Thank <laughs> you. 
good ball into the box. Could it be a third? Bowers have put on a stunning attacking display, like first 10 minutes of the game. So it looks like this could be a goal fest. Two goals in like the first five minutes of the game. So yeah, very impressed so far. <laughs> A massive opportunity to make it free there for Bowers, but a bit of a miscue with the header. Bright didn't see a let off there. Oh, it could be three. He's kept it on. Oh, two Bowers players in the box there. We missed the opportunity to poke it into the back of the net for free. So unlucky. Chance of crossing to the box. There's a corner for Bowers and Pitsy. Good block from the Brighton Sea defender from the, the cross from Brad Warner. Only player I know the name of. <laughs> or no goal? Oh. I'm going goal as well. I thought, no, 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 goal. No, no goal, yeah? No goal. I'm going goal. No. Okay, corner's about to be whipped in. The ball! Oh, just over the bar! I'm going goal. No. Corner's Brighton Sea region. Just missed the goal, unfortunately. Bowers have just increased their lead to three. Saw it coming, to be fair. Great attacking display from them in this first half. And, uh, well, they've managed to put three past Brighton and see in this first half. So, who knows how many they'll be able to put past them in the second or even in the closing minutes of this first half. But, yeah, great first half display from them. 3 0. Uh, yeah, it'd be great to see how many they can score in throughout this match. Free kick to Bowers and Pitsu. See if they can put in a good delivery. But he's played it short, played it through, Bab Warner on the wing, delivery into the box. Oh, it's 4 0! In the first half, Bowers are 4 0 up. A brilliant delivery into the box by Brad Warner. And uh, a touch into the back of the net makes it 4 0, Bowers and Pitsy. What an amazing first half! Wow! <laughs> well, I think this may just settle. Who will win this game? Of course, still have another 45 minutes after this. But surely, that is the ins it, surely this is the icing on the cake for Bowers and Pitsy taking three points out of this game. Four nil in the first half. And that is half time. An extremely amazing first half display from Bowers and Pitsy. 4-0 the half-time score. Bowers and Pitts will be very happy and pleased to go in at half-time with that score. I'm sure Rob Small, the Bowers gaffer, will be happy with that. Um, Bowers supporters will be very pleased as well. Mia, what are your thoughts on that? Thing? Despite the fact that you missed two of the goals. Uh, I don't know, it's good. It's good, yes. Is that all you have to say? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, a very, very good first half display from Bowers and Pitsy. Hopefully they can score a few more goals in the second half because uh, that'd be very, very good. Yeah, very entertaining. And uh, talk to you in the second half. It's a very, very impressive first half performance um, and a very, very impressive first half display from Bounds and Pitsy. 4-0 at half time. Very, very impressive. I did not expect that at all to be coming here and seeing Bowers 4-0 up at half time. It's absolutely insane. So, yeah, hopefully they can show more of that in the second half and maybe score more goals because that will make this vlog just absolutely amazing. But, yeah, honestly, just after that first half performance, I can't wait to watch the rest of the game and upload this vlog. And, uh, well, we're not even at the 90th minute yet. So, uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully we'll see a, like, much similar first half, like much similar second half to the first one, because that was brilliant. Oh, oh, it's took a deflection. Keeper's called off a save. He's put it out from the corner and it almost hit me here in the face. It's going to be a good header there. <laughs> it's like he's deliberately done it. Are you happy now that we're under the shelter? Yeah. Can't really see it, but yep. Kicked in by Brad Warner. Oh, it's 5 0 Bowers. There it is. It's the fifth goal. <laughs> a header into the back of the net. And I think we can say that Bowers and Pitsy have definitely got three points in the bag. 
we knew that after the first half display. But yeah, but fifth goal, I think that just sealed it now. So I'm just walking around to the toilet. I've missed a, a second goal. It's now 6 0 Bowers and Pitsy. Um, yeah, I didn't actually see the goals, I can't describe it to you, but 6 0 Bowers. So uh, yeah, they're just rubbing the salt in the wounds of Brighton C0. Um, yeah, <laughs> what a mad game. Don't regret coming at all. And let's see how many more they can score now. three points a while ago but that just rubs even more salt into the wounds of Brighton City and Regent but yeah a stunning performance from Bowers and Pitsy tonight and can they add to the amazing scoreline they've already got 7-0 Making it eight for our ex Pasley United player, Brad Walker, with the chance. Is a chance to make it eight. Oh, the keeper has pulled off a rare save. It's a rare sight in this game. Oh, ooh, almost messed that one up. Decent effort from Bowers there. Three minutes of added time until full time. And uh, I'm sure Bowers will be extremely, extremely pleased with this uh, brilliant performance. Right, so, a very, very entertaining game from Bowers and Pitsy, the full time score, of course. Um, Bowers and Pitsy 7, Brighton and Seaham Region 0. Um, wow, um, really happy I went to this game because uh, really good vlog to get uploaded. I think, yeah, this is probably the biggest scoreline we'll have uploaded to our channel. Um, yeah, so this, this will probably be the biggest scoreline we've had, we'll have uploaded to our channel. Um, yeah, brilliant game to come to, really enjoyed it. Rivalry aside, really good to see Bowers doing well. Um, now I think Brighton and City are like near the bottom of the table so to be fair I did expect Bowers to win however I didn't expect it to be 7-0 Mia did you expect it to be 7-0? Nope No? What were your thoughts on the game as a whole? Uh, well the first half like Bowers obviously won a lot Well yeah Yeah obviously Their attacking display was, in, um, was outstanding 4-0 at half time of course I think in the beginning of the second half um, the other team were quite actually good they um, also they didn't get any goals but their defender was a bit better for them towards like the middle to the end of the first half. They were just crashing them. Yeah. To be fair, they were out of the contest by the t by, uh, <laughs> after the fourth goal. To be fair, after that first half, I think they were out the content the cont contest. Um, I feel like they could have come back into it if they managed to score four goals. However, I mean that first half, I think, just decided the game. And after that fifth goal in that second half, just it just settled the game and just made it clear that Bowers would get three points. Well, it, I say that, but then, I, like I say, after the fourth goal in that first half, I think that just settled the game as a whole. You know, it, it was clear to see Bowers would get three points. But yeah, an outstanding performance from Bowers today. Really glad we came. Um, thank you very much for watching today's vlog. As always, can we try and hit, um, can we try and hit 30 likes on this video? It would be much appreciated. Um, yeah, make sure you like. Please subscribe. We're about 30. No. 25 subscribers away from 400 so if we could get there that'd be absolutely amazing i'll tell you what set a challenge if we can get to 400 subscribers before the end of the month we'll do some sort of giveaway um so yeah thank you very much for watching as always if you did enjoy like we say please leave a like please subscribe it's become very dark now because there's not many street lights around um yeah please check out sponsors premier velocity link down below if you're looking for a 4x4 sports car prestige vehicle you know supercars are higher then these are the people to go to link down in the description in the um on the video go on to our social medias there'll be links there as well um yeah thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed and uh yeah we'll see you in the next match day vlog which should be saturday uh Basel united against cambridge city at home uh yeah see you in the next vlog people have a nice week
Okay, before you click off of this video, um, I just want to give a quick shout out to a fan of this YouTube channel. His name is Joseph on Tour, um, and he has his own YouTube channel. Please go and check it out. He vlogs football matches. He, well, he's going to be anyway. Um, yeah, addicted to football. He's a Chelsea fan, you know, and he's going to be vlogging football matches. Please go check him out. Link in the description and picture on screen here. Please get him to 200 subscribers. You will really appreciate it, and so will I, given the support you give me. And uh, yeah, see you in the next video.